Hey there guys, my name is Andrew Tronta and I wanted to make this video because we have a very big week ahead, okay? So obviously uh, we're here to talk about a census surgical, um, uh, formerly known as TRXC, Transenterix, and um, I'm super excited to go over uh, some very important things that are going to be happening this week. And on top of that, guys, things to be excited about, the stimulus checks um, bill did get passed by the Senate. Um, it's going to get approved by the House, um, and uh, we should see it uh, coming to us very soon. Um, when the checks are going to come out, I'm not exactly sure, but considering that there is a bit of urgency in this, we could be looking at something between um, the end of March, early April. Um, that's just, you know, that's just a, a guess. I, I really couldn't, don't, don't, don't uh, hold me to that. So, uh, the reason why I want to make this video today was because, guys, the Census Surgical is about to have a killer week. I have a good feeling, at least. Um, obviously, today is Sunday, um, uh, March 7th. Uh, I just had my birthday this weekend. That's why I couldn't uh, do the whole video on Friday, which I normally do, just because I had to get myself to AC. Did very well for myself. Made some money. I'm excited to get back into a census. Hoping for a dip. I mean, it's already dipped so much, so I might just buy but um, we will definitely see what happens come Monday morning in pre-market. Um, so going forward, I really love their website, by the way. If you guys haven't been on their website, I definitely recommend checking this thing out. This is, this is no joke. This is a very serious website. Very fun to go through. Um, you know, very, very, very powerful stuff here, and I really like it. And you can see here, I have the tab open already, but this is like the investors uh, area you can see. And you can check out all of their investor relations. Um, and you can go into a lot of different things they have. Obviously, they're in the New York Stock Exchange. And they have their ticket ticker that runs on the right-hand side here. And then on top of that, we also have um, all of the most recent news, which is the fact that they are announcing their finalization of name and ticker symbol change, which is fantastic. They did that very quickly. Um, I've had companies that have done that actually in the past, or the last company I was involved in for a little bit, uh, which was PEIX, now now known as Alto Ingredients, ALTO, and that took a few months actually. So they they really they really just went for it. They just were like, we're doing this now. So I really do appreciate that. Um, so going into uh, the I guess why I think the next week is gonna be so big. I mean, we we have some huge things coming on. So. Let's go right into the press releases right here. Um, their scheduling and the uh, their earnings report, their earnings and whatnot, uh, call for March 11th, 2021. So that's this week, folks. That's going to be this week, uh, March 11th, 2021. That's going to be a really, really big uh, week. And for March uh, also, we have, or this week, we also have a conference, the AC Wainwright Global Life Sciences Conference, um, which will be taking place actually uh, between two dates, um, between the 9th and the 10th. I'm not sure which one. They might be going through both. Um, and now that, okay. It's looking like the company's presentation will be available on demand beginning Tuesday, March 9, 2021. Okay, so... There's going to be a presentation. It's probably not going to be anything we haven't already seen, folks. So if, you're, if you've been with a census for a while now, uh, this isn't something new. But at the same point in time, it's still something you want to, um, you know, be excited about. Because that could be, you know, more investors, you know, and, and more, uh, more, more buyers. So, and, and also possible price target changes, um, which are what we're looking at uh, for earnings changes. I think the earnings will be a beat. And I think that the earnings will also... Uh, um, come with it, improve financials, which will make uh, price uh, changes be, be necessary by analysts. So I think analysts will have to raise their price targets with this proper earnings. And then on top of that, I also think that there will be, um, you know, I mean, there should be a decent amount of good things happening with the stimulus check coming in. So, you know, we have three really big catalysts this week, guys. We have the stimulus checks that just got into law, right? And we know this is going to happen. Um, and the second is we have the uh, the conference and we have earnings. So those are three big factors in the market. Those are just three positive things. Obviously, guys, we had FDA approval the other week and the stock went down. So, you know, it, it's, <laughs> it's, 
it's laughing it's laughable because of how ridiculous it really is when you really think about what that meant for the company and what that means for the applicability of the company and uh the company's uh flagship Sundance program so it's really kind of hilarious but yeah like i said you know, I mean, we don't know what's going to happen, obviously, you know, I mean, this market does whatever it wants to do, you know, I mean, there's good things that are happening that should mean more investors come if you're looking for short term profits. But if you're like me, and you're longing, if you're doing a long term hold um, upwards to five years, that's some that's where I like to see myself. Uh, this really doesn't really matter. Um, just going to be doing uh, long term options uh, for as long out as humanly possible. That's really what I'm, my goal is. Um, so yeah, with that being said, uh, like I said, please, I'm going to put, leave a link in the description for the website to a census. I think that that's a really great, valuable resource to, um, to go and see and, and be on as much as possible because they do really put a lot of effort into this website and this isn't just a little jokey website. Like this is pretty good stuff. So you can also see all of the SEC filings and you can see, um, you can see, uh, any, uh, old, um, earnings reports and stuff like that. So it's really cool. I mean, this would be like the events and presentations and you can see, you know, you can listen to the webcast, uh, AC Wainwright virtual, virtual global life sciences conference. So, you know, there's a lot of stuff that we could really be looking into here. So it's, it's good. It's good stuff. I like it. Um, with that being said, guys, thank you so much for joining me. This isn't going to be a very long video. I just want to bring you guys up with a forward looking statement. What are we looking at guys? Remember, we're looking at three things. We're looking at earnings. Okay. We're looking at the conference and we're looking at the stimulus check to hopefully bank, uh, bring the market back up. So let's see what happens. Let's see if this, if people buy the dip, if people buy the dip guys, I mean, listen, remember it ended pretty strong. If people buy the dip, we could be looking at a very strong week. Um, and we can maybe carry that momentum all the way into, uh, the rest of March. So let's definitely, uh, reconvene Friday guys, reconvene Friday, obviously join the discord. Um, please, if you could support me on my Patreon, that'd be really helpful. Um, the links are in the description. I hope you guys have a great rest of your week and, uh, good luck to you. All right. Bye-bye.